Hey everybody, it's Kansas Misfit here, and I don't know if I'm upside down or not. I think I am. I apologize if I am. I'm holding my camera, I mean my phone, that's all I have until I get enough money to get me a phone, I mean a camera. So, bear with me. I'm going to turn the camera around now and I'm going to show you how I'm going to make some tea that... Who was making it? Uh, trying to think who was making it. I think it was uh, Doug and Stacy, uh, Stacy off of Doug and Stacy's homestead. So check them out if you want. They're, they taught me this, and now I'm going to teach it to you. So it's lemongrass and marigolds. Here we go. Right now I'm pulling this flowers off the marigolds. I already got the lemongrass in the water soaking, releasing, releasing any bugs or dirt from the leaves. And doing the same thing with the flowers. I'm doing this one-handed, so bear with me. I've never made this before. It's my birthday today, so it's a, a little treat I'm doing from my mom and I. And if my daughter comes over, which she's planning on, I'll let her have some too. Boy, this smells strong. Smell that, Mom. <laughs> Pretty strong, isn't it? Yeah, now that's what we're going to be drinking when I get it made. Uh, got a little lighter flower now. <laughs> My fingers are going to smell like this all day. One of these days, I'll have me a GoPro or something where I can actually do proper videos but until then use what you got and make it work like that song someplace on the radio fake it till you make it <laughs> that's that's what I'm gonna do that's Kansas Misfit Whew. these flowers are strong now the yellow ones I believe um, Stacy off of Doug and Stacy's channel made a salad with her marigolds and put it in her salad. And then she had rice and I don't remember what else. It looked like a pretty good meal to me. Got my hot water in the jar. I actually spilt it on the table. But I got my hot water in the jar there. I'm waiting on the rest to go in to the pot or the jar and then we'll see what happens after that that's gonna be some strong tea mix it up a little bit with the back of the spoon They look pretty. Okay. I don't see anything floating around in there. But I'm going to try to strain it. I think I'm going to try to strain it over the kitchen sink. Because <laughs> I'm doing this one handed. So we'll move this to the sink first. Flip the light on so we can see what we're not doing. You ever heard that line before? Well, that was nice. And let's go get the rest. We'll pour this in and strain it through. 
and then we'll add more hot water. Oh, I gotta put it all in there. I don't know. <laughs> okay, I gotta put the flowers in there now because it has to steam it sit in there with the hot in the hot water. Well, you can see don't strain it before, strain it after. This is new to me, guys. Like I said, I've never did it before. But I'm doing it. Anyway, that's how you do it. Fill that up with hot water. And get it as hot as I can. Add, it, add the hot water. Then when you're when it's through. So, uh, steaming or what do you call it soaking um, then I strain it through and then I add whatever sweetener you want you can have sweet and low you can have stevia you can have honey you can have plain for unsweetened tea and um, this is supposed to be really healthy so we'll see how it turns out well you I will see how it turns out. <laughs> this is my birthday tea. So, happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday, dear Marsha. Happy birthday to me. Yep. If you like this channel, please subscribe. And if you leave a comment, tell me your name. Let me see who's watching my videos. Uh, I like to to know who's watching the videos. You want to let that steam. Smash the like button. And I'll get back with you tomorrow. I hope you have a wonderful day. Ta-ta for now.